My CBI contact on the committee has informed us that the project to delete the zeros will be expanded shortly after the November election period in the United States. The process of switching to the newer lower denominations will begin during this time period, which runs through December. This also translates to roughly a 1 colon 1 parity between the IQD and the US dollar. But keep in mind that this only applies to international locations. Keep in mind that these actions always depend on one another. Nothing is certain. Today, I want to be very clear with you about this, my CBI contact on the committee has informed us that the project to delete the zeros will be expanded shortly after the November election period in the United States. The process of switching to the newer lower denominations will begin during this time period, which runs through December. This also translates to roughly a 1 colon 1 parity between the IQD and the US dollar. But keep in mind that this only applies to international locations. Keep in mind that these actions always depend on one another. Nothing is certain. Today, I want to be very clear with you about this. According to Iraqi Dinar Intel Guru Mark Z, via PDK I wish to draw attention to this one. What causes the US dollar's exchange rate to fluctuate I realized that before to the Kuwaiti revaluation, similar kinds of articles began to surface. Naturally, I had friends in the military at the time who were stationed there. As a result, Kuwait was providing me with frequent updates. To find out if they were correct, I, followed it. They publish stories claiming that everything is steady one day. Articles stating that things are unstable and changing are published the next day. To keep us off balance, they continue to disseminate contradicting articles. This is significant and precisely what we saw before to Kuwait's revaluation. The media regularly airs commercials explaining how the switch will work. The cash center that just opened in Kark is then mentioned by Iraqi media. It is only used to get the $3 or 0 dinar notes. People are already taking in the 3 zero notes, so the process of getting rid of zeros has officially begun. Yes, according to my CBI contact, it is underway. According to Guru Nader from the Mideast, we can now pay anywhere in the world using the Iraqi dinar. I can pay people in the United States from Iraq, for the time being. It's $1,310, but I can send you $500. I am referring to business, not interpersonal relationships. I'm referring to business. Before that, we can't do that, according to Iraqi Dinar News Hound Guru Claire, the article, Hybrid Monetary Policy. Al Sudani's advisor reveals the central bank's new step by reducing the interest rate at which the central bank works with banks from 7.5% to 5.5%. The central bank started reducing the monetary policy interest rate by around 200 percentage points on October 24. This indicates an expansionary policy aimed at the money supply. Notwithstanding the aforementioned, the new policy did not downplay the significance of maintaining local liquidity levels and conducting high sterilization operations by providing debt instruments known as Islamic Certificates of Deposit, which are excellent debts with a return of 4% for 14 days and a return of 5.5% for 182 days. These debt instruments are regarded as sovereign debts that can be mortgaged or discounted in the secondary market.